What we have here is one of the easiest mods that uh, I've ever done. Uh, this is a 9 LED flashlight powered by three AAA batteries. Um, I really can't stand AAA batteries. But somebody invented them and they make millions and billions per year and they have about 600 milliamps capacity at best. And what they do when they're placed in here is they run around and make a connection in series uh, to reveal about four to four and a half volts. And um, what that looks like is this. Now, over the years of buying several laptops because they don't last forever, uh, this is what a cell looks like in your laptop battery. And uh, there's eight of them. And what typically happens when your battery and your laptop starts holding about 10 minutes worth of charge? One of these out of the eight is defective. The other seven are, in most cases, ready to receive a charge and discharge. They're still good. So, what we have here is three cells left from this discovery and collection of these uh, these cells and I thought well you know what let's just see what these do I'm interested you know I've discovered with a voltmeter that uh, a lot of them still hold a nice charge and it so happens within a tenth of a volt these three triple A's ah, they ran off hold exactly the same charge as one of these. So I thought, well, let's see if it fits. Well, it doesn't. I mean, it kind of does. Look at this. Flashlight, AAA is removed. This is what it looks like. By sticking this battery down here, it more than reaches. It reaches so well you can't screw this on. But, this is a, a, uh, an insight into what this will do, because you can push that so hard that it'll, you can stick it over and make the light shine. No, oh, maybe you can't. I had it going earlier. There we go. One with less spring tension. Alright, and this is what this mod's for. This is really what's going on here. You see that? That's pretty awesome. I mean, that is not only super bright, uh, the difference in the capacity in these, though they're the same voltage, is 4,000 milliamps in this compared to, th compared to 600. Now, if you use rechargeables because you're trying to be green, that's even better, but there's less voltage and less capacity uh, involved. So, uh, not only is this rechargeable, um, by the time we're done, it's going to end up fitting right down there and you won't have to hold this there. I have just the thing to add to extend this so you can put it together, thread it together and have a flashlight for, I don't know, a, a zillion years. The secret ingredient to extending this is something that carries electricity itself. This is 7 eighths conduit and because we only need so much I mean that's almost closed I can almost just thread that right in and be done but that's why we're here because it won't if you cut about an inch off to inch and a quarter of your 7 8 conduit the magic of this material not only is it conductive in itself but it shelters electricity a lot of times what goes down here is um, Romex so it covers something conductive and it is conductive itself because it's just galvanized steel the magic in this mod with your inch and a quarter conduit is to put a cotton ball stuffed really far down there because when you cut this in half with your cutting wheel you don't want junk getting all over the electrical components down in there. It's where you make contact once you shove your battery in there. 
you cut it in half, clean it all up, take your cotton ball back out, you'll have two pieces. This fits perfectly. Deburring that a little bit. You got a file. It helps to turn the edge of your inch and a quarter piece on your file. Deburr your cut here. Your inch and a quarter piece jams perfectly. So perfectly, it's awesome. This is an awesome mod to do because of what's used and how it works. And you jam that in, having cut this in half equally on each side, leaving about a quarter of an inch because that's what's going to extend your tube with the conduit. And when you drop this in there, with the conduit in place, having stretched this, you'll be able to put this on and tighten it in and, and have a flashlight that works by the button back here just like it does with the triple A's. This is what you're extending. Look at that. That's all you have to do is extend this housing about a half an inch more than the original battery pack in there and people will see this right after you've, you're finished and it's so cool because it's going to look like a worm it'll have a big section here it goes down to a small section then you got another big section and they'll say why does that flashlight look like that I have one like this and it doesn't look like that he says well yeah you know because you I look at the battery that's in there and you'll be able to take that out and you say look not only will this flashlight last forever um, I think it only runs on about a hundred milliamps per hour when it's on so 10 hours per amp and you have four amps so it has 40 hours of runtime and these are rechargeable so um, that concludes that's all you need to know about this mod I've got three of these these are sometimes free as a promotional and uh, I'm going to make three flashlights that run for absolutely ever with uh, lithium-ion cells you may have in a laptop battery you've had around because you haven't recycled it yet